Do you recognize this guy? No? What about now? Three, two, one. But who is this guy? This is Max Major, and he goes by the name of The Mind Hacker. He's a world-renowned mentalist living in Las Vegas, Nevada. His performances showcasing real-life Jedi mind tricks are featured at corporate events around the world. In addition to his studies and influence, Major relies heavily on his skills of reading body language, which he has owned over the course of 3,500 live shows. His clients include the world's largest corporations like Facebook, Microsoft, CSX, Costco, Google, as well as a command performance for the world's elite Chief Justice John Roberts, Redskin owner Dan Snyder, eccentric billionaire Richard Branson, and more. In 2020, Max Major was invited to compete in the 15th season of America's Got Talent. In addition to being the breakout star of the season, he became the first contestant in the history of AGT to make it from an online audition all the way up to the finals. After witnessing Max Major's mind reading firsthand, Simon Cowell called it one of the most astonishing things I've ever seen in my entire life. In addition to his work on television, Max Major is the most followed mentalist on the entire planet. His viral videos performing mind readings to strangers have surpassed over 1 billion views in 2022. In the last 5 years, he has been called before to Department of Defense intelligence agencies to demonstrate his innovative techniques and hypnosis, body language and influence. So it seemed that Max Major's career was going uphill. But during the last couple of days, Max Major's career has been going downhill. Let me read you one of the articles that came out yesterday. A major controversy erupted during the ongoing Mavithon 2 stream of celebrity streamer Kai Sinat after a mentalist and magician named Max Major pulled off an outrageous stunt on the stream. Major, who was at Kai Sinat's mansion from where he conducts his streams, put his head on a looped rope and gave Kai Sinat the option to pull one of the two handles. When Kai did not, the stunt turned ugly looking, with Max Major seemingly hanging. Other crew members such as Sexy Red, who was also a guest on that stream, seemed visibly upset and disturbed by the situation. The stream also had to be abruptly stopped. But the question everybody is asking is, why did he do it? But it all goes back to almost one year ago when Max made his first appearance on Kai's channel. And he felt disrespected in some way, so he tried to get revenge and tried to get Kai banned. But three days ago, this video was uploaded, titled A Message to Kai Sinat on Max Major's YouTube channel. In the trick, Major explained that he had planned the trick from before, and in a way where it would not raise suspicions. The group also clarified that piling out the handles was artificially constructed and no one was injured or hurt. But to make everything a little bit more clear, here's the video. If you're watching this, that means that something has gone terribly wrong. But what you don't know is that was all according to my plan. You see, at the start of my performance, I said that tonight was all about choices. But not just the choices that you made tonight, the choices that you've made since the day that we met. Well, so today I got on. I got a Maori to pull up. No, the objective is to catch this nigga in his lives. Straight up. Niggas gotta be behind him. Niggas gotta be on the sides. Niggas gotta be watching every oh, angle. Bullshit. I know how Mark Cards look, chat, so I'm on his ass. Ah! I had to look. I wanted to see that go through his lip. I kept trying to fuck with him, like trying to. <laughs> so he better ask this for me. We really trying to prove you wrong. We fuck. I'm so glad it had ran it over. God's ass. I don't even fuck with him. Oh, 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 What's wrong with you, bro? For real. You see, from the first time we met, you pushed me, you challenged me, you wanted to see me fail. And I thought tonight, I'd give you exactly what you asked for. You see, you thought the game was for me to influence you to make the right choice. But all along, I planned to influence you to make the wrong choice. And I knew you'd pick the red handle. You see, even when it feels like you're playing a game of chance, you have to remember who you're playing against. Because I decide who wins or loses. People are trying to figure out if Kai was in on this the whole time and if he knew this was going to happen and if he did know this was going to happen, he should actually get banned. But what are your opinions on this? Let me know that in the comment section. My name is Matilardini. Peace out.